See you, Sandesh. From the past few days, I've been getting some queries from the students. Sir, Corona situation is bad. Things exams already are cancelled once, and even in November 2020, I'm not sure whether exams are going to happen. So really, I'm not finding that motivation to study. Could you please help me? So I thought I'd share my thoughts on this particular topic. Okay, I understand no doubt situation is bad, not just for you, but almost for every person in this world. Millions of people have have lost their jobs. Thousands of them had to walk thousands of kilometers just to get to their native place. Hmm? Many people are still struggling just to have three meals a day. So situation no doubt is bad for everybody. Hmm? Does it mean we should give up now? We are exams are generally. For a moment, let's assume that you are not a student who is preparing for professional course. For a moment, let's assume ourselves to be an Olympic athlete, or let's say there is an Olympic athlete. He is preparing for a hundred meter sprint at the Olympics. Hmm? Let's say that sprint, or generally that sprint takes about ten to twelve seconds. It's about roughly it's a ten second affair. But for that ten second affair, do you think that athlete is just going to put ten seconds of his life? As efforts, or thousand seconds as efforts? No. Some of them train for five years, ten years of their life they give up for that purpose. Correct. So that means ten years of their life, no partying, no having junk food, following the same routine, hardly getting any sleep. Correct. Now somebody just comes up to them and says, "This year no more Olympics." What do you think must be going through their mind at that moment when somebody says that to them? You must be feeling absolutely shattered, devastated. Correct. Ten years of their life, they feel went for nothing. Correct. Do you think now that particular athlete is going to give up, saying it's not worth it, or what he's going to do himself? Few days, no doubt, he's going to feel down and low. After that, he's going to convince himself. Actually, this particular corona is a blessing in this case. It's a total blessing for me. Now I'm going to train even more. I'm going to make my tra- training program even more rigorous. Put in more efforts, shatter the record, and make sure that I win that gold medal and make myself, my country, and my family proud. Yes or no? So I say, be that athlete or find that athlete in yourself. Everybody has that athlete. You just have to find it. Now all you have to do is think: Why did you take that particular professional course, like a CA, CS, or ACC, for that matter? Maybe if somebody told you this is one of the toughest courses in the world, and you want to prove them wrong, or you somebody told you if you become a CA or a CS or for that matter anything else, like uh, it gives you a tremendous name and money for that purpose you join doesn't matter. Fine, just convince yourself now. Like I'm going to get better. I'm going. This actually this COVID situation is a blessing in disguise. I'm going to use this time to better myself. Like if you are a, let's say CA inter student, you had plans to write one group. Now convince yourself that I have more time. I'm going to write both the groups and clear off all the C A eight papers in one shot. Or if you had already plans to write both the groups, convince yourself that now I have an opportunity to get a rank. Yes. So use this time to better yourself. Don't ever give up. All these are small hiccups or obstacles, and hiccups and obstacles are part and parcel of life. Learn to live with it because they only come to make you stronger. As the saying goes. When the things get tough, the tough gets going. So I say, relax, Marty. Chill, relax, Marty. Study, no Marty. Stay safe. Take care.